I get my own comm device. Technically, it was Crosshairs, but he doesn't appear to be needing it. Omega expressed excitement as Tech outfits her with a comm link. Omega wore a white tunic with red and blue sleeves, black pants, and black boots. She had a Kaminoan style forehead pendant which she wore in her hair, although she removed it and altered her hairstyle after escaping Silukami. Her overall outfit reflected that of Nala Shea. During the mission to Ord Mantle, Tech provided her with a wrist mounted communicator, formerly Crosshairs. On the same mission, she acquired a retractable Zygerian energy bow that she went on to use in combat. However, she was quite ineffective using the weapon at first due to not being practiced or strong enough to shoot straight. The wrist comm was destroyed by Cad Bane on Bora Vio and she was provided with a standard comm link. During her time on Pantora, Omega ended up taking a clone trooper doll without paying. She considered the toy trooper to be a female like herself, painting her armor black to make the doll a member of the Bad Batch. For Omega, the doll was not only one of her only playthings and a comfort to her when she was scared, but a connection to her past life on Kamino as well as her new life with the Bad Batch. She also co-owned Rekka's Tuka doll, Lula, 